Okay, so hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Um, and in today's video, I am doing a tutorial, which I think this is like my one of my first tutorials on this channel. Um, basically on how to do my Farrah Fawcett curls. I don't, they're not quite Farrah curls, but they're fairly similar, I'd say. Um, but first of all. Just to quickly mention, my hair's really greasy because I've got jojoba oil in it and I haven't washed it in a, quite a while because I got back off holiday yesterday and it's all been a bit chaotic. So it's looking just not nice at the moment, which is why I wanted to do this video. Just to like freshen my hair up a little bit, make me feel good, all of that. Um, so yeah. <laughs> Also, another thing to mention, to get the exact hairstyle that I'm going to do, you do have to have layers in your hair. So my hair is layered, I'll show you from the back. So like, you've got the um, like top layer, I think is like here, and then one here, and then the longest one at the bottom. And um, also, curtain bangs like that so you've got the short layer medium layer and the long layer so yeah my hair is layered um which gives you the uh, like a the fountainy kind of effect um but you can still do this look without um layers it will look slightly different but it is still possible um so yeah Okay guys, so I just got out of the bath and I dried my hair, it's like 90% dry, sprayed it with um, heat protector and I'm just going to quickly whiz over it again with the blow dryer and then we'll get on to curling. Okay, so I'm just going to section my hair like this, put the shortest layer out of the way. And then we're just going to quickly do the bottom layer. So what you're going to do is you're going to pull down and then you pull away from your head like that. And it will just be a cute little cut like that. And the same again. Straighten as if you straighten in it and then flip up. And then say hi to the channel. Say hi, Sasha.
and that is the bottom layer done. And then we're going to take the top layer out of the bubble, brush it, rub straight this down, and twist and wipe. Then you don't want to apply too much pressure and just slowly track it away from the face. By the way, I'm doing this on the lowest heat, so it's on 150, which is the lowest my straightener is can go to, and it's from Revamp. In case anyone wanted to know, and then you don't do anything else different apart from when you get to the fringe, which I'll show you. But for now, I'll just time lapse this bit. So now for the last step, you just get your bangs and your fringe and you just chop it a little bit, split it into two. And it will go a bit crazy, but it will look good after. Okay, I'm going to switch off the straighteners and give that a quick hairspray. And if you want more volume, there is the option to put um, rollers in, but I don't have time for that. Um, so I'll be back in like two seconds once these are set. And I've missed a bit. Mm -hmm. So what we do is get a brush, a round brush specifically, and Pull that forwards like that. Just so the curls sit nice and away from the face. And that will get nicer throughout the day once it's lost the, the frizziness. So thank you all so much for watching and we'll see you in the next one.